Hi, I'm Anna Posniak. I'm the Windsor Town Clerk. And recently you received your absentee ballot application in the mail that was sent out by the Secretary of the State's office. For this upcoming primary, you do need to be registered as a Republican or a Democrat to vote. If you have not received your application, please give our office a call. If you are an unaffiliated voter or someone who wishes to become a voter and participate in the upcoming primary, there's still time to fill out your voter registration card. You can stop by the Windsor Town Hall and visit the town clerk's office or the registrar's office up to 12 noon on Monday, August 10th to register with either the Democratic or Republican Party and participate in the primary on August 11th. After the town clerk's office receives your application, you will receive a ballot in the mail. Inside the envelope will be your ballot. In addition to that, there is going to be an inner envelope and an outer envelope. After you are done voting your ballot, you will insert the ballot into the inner envelope and you are going to date and sign the inner envelope. With the ballot enclosed in that envelope, you are going to insert it into this outer envelope that contains your information that's specific to you. You will seal this envelope and then you can return it to the town clerk's office in one of three ways. And one way to return your ballot is to mail it. And another way is to drop your absentee ballot at the official absentee ballot drop box located in the rear parking lot of Town Hall located at 275 Broad Street. For those of you who are concerned about the security of the box, as you can see, the slot is very small. I can only fit up to my knuckle in it. And it does have three separate locks that require three separate keys. And I am the only person who has access to those keys. This box is available to all voters 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And finally, you can always bring your absentee ballot to the Windsor Town Clerk's Office. We are open Monday through Friday from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. And for those voters who would prefer to go to the polls, all seven polls will be open from 6 a.m. to 8 p.m. We will be implementing safety measures because your health is our priority and your vote is your voice, so make it count.